Alright everybody, so I picked up this Craftsman lawnmower yesterday off the side of the road. It's a 2007 model. It, is, it has a 625 series Briggs and Stratton engine on it. It's 6 and 1 quarter gross torque. And it's a 190cc engine. This is a 22 inch cut mower. It is soft propelled front wheel drive. This thing used to have an electric start. Um, and I'm going to probably have to get a parts mower because it's missing the air filter. Um, hopefully I can find one. I actually did find one on Craigslist that I can use. This thing looks like oil doesn't look too bad. May need to be changed. I don't know. This thing's actually missing the uh, pull string. Um, and it didn't come with its bag. I just found this for free off the curb yesterday. Now, this is another Craftsman over here. You can probably tell, but it's only a year old. It's from, it's from 2020. Um, it says it right here. Data manufacturer. June 2020. Yep. Now... I thought I'd put this in the video. It's the one I was talking about in the first video of the Husqvarna mower. That'll be put in the description if you want to see it. This thing needs a new head gasket. Um, it had a problem where it was smoking um, and leaking oil. I wonder if the head gasket will fix it. I don't know. Hopefully it should fix it. This thing came with its bag. Yep. There we go. This thing is still pretty nice, and a very fancy thing about this being a newer mower is that it's pretty light. You can um, compare it to what it looks like with this mower. Look at that. It's a bit beefier. Because I think that has a wooden deck, and I think this one has a plastic deck. The wheels are plastic on here. Um, but anyways, uh, hopefully I can get this one fixed. It may end up being beyond repair. I don't know. Hopefully I can get this one fixed. And, uh, I'm gonna try and get a parts mower to use. I may have to get a new blade control cable. I'm gonna have to totally get a new pull string, obviously. And, uh, I, this thing's actually got a bit of an issue that either I'll fix or I'm probably just gonna scrap the frame. So, the self repel cable... It was designed in a bit of a poor way because instead of like the tabs would go in right here, they go in right here on the outside instead of on the inside. And the self repel seems to engage because when this thing's, when I engage it and I pull it back, the wheels seem to lock. So that totally says that the, uh, the self repel works but let me see if I can do it again and so you can see it but well uh, I don't know if I can get it to happen oh wait yeah it came out if you if you slide this in to get it in properly um, it could come out and I think that's kind of a bit of something I don't like I don't know what I'm going to do, either fix it or just scrap this mower frame up. Uh, I don't know. Uh, however, I may put it on that Craftsman mower's deck because I don't know if this thing's going to end up being able to be repaired or not. I don't know. Anyway, I may give some more videos on these mowers if I get them working or maybe I'll tell you if the... Uh, if they just can't be repaired. Anyways, 
that's all I have to say for this video, and thank you for watching.